For the first time since the March 15 mosque attacks in Christchurch in New Zealand, the Al Noor Mosque, where the shooting occurred, reopened its doors to worshippers. Eight days ago, the mosque was the site of a gruesome massacre when a gunman opened fire, killing 42 unarmed worshippers. Today, Muslims once again entered the mosque to offer prayers. Many of them were survivors of the attack. Meanwhile, some 3,000 people walked through, the, walked through Christchurch for a March for Love rally that was intended to honor the victims of the attack. This whole thing brings us all together. It shows that Islam has no terrorism and the world needs to know that. Um, yeah, so the, it showed us that a lot of people came together and showed us the support and that's how we mentally coping. No matter where we're from or our religious beliefs or our world view, we're all here for the same reason, to share the message of hope. Ever since those attacks in Christchurch, New Zealand's Prime Minister Jacinda Ardern has been receiving global praise for her courage and empathy in the aftermath of the attack. This includes her government's decision to alter the country's gun laws immediately. On Thursday, Ardern announced a ban on all types of semi-automatic weapons.